Hello and welcome to QGPIndiaEducations.com Blogspot.in In this video I am going to show you how you can create the folders What are the different folder structures and file actions in QDB If any you save the QDB script or a test uh, The one folder is created So let us say that we have created one folder as a book now the under the main folder there will be another uh, folder so depending upon how many actions you have created so uh, action 0 and action 1 so by default there is action 0 is there so if you create uh, no, if you uh, by default action 0 is created and uh, for any test save action 1 is created, created automatically so this folder will be created and uh, there will be uh, below files there there will be below mention files are all there default.cfg that is text file web and network configuration is there then default.usb that is text file action iteration settings are there then default.excel that is data tables of the test is stored there then parameters.mtr that is binary file and the book.usr that is text file test name file then test.tsp that is binary file that contains test settings now uh, as i said there are actions are created uh, action 0 and action 1 so action for each action there will be uh, uh, below files there will be one folder snapshots that is stores the images of the applications if you have activated that and uh, there will be uh, below files for each action that is object repository dot bdb that is a local object repository then resources dot mtr script dot mts that is actually script uh, written in that uh, test and then analog track list dot dat other files and their extensions in uh, qdp are dot vbs dot txt dot qfl these are qfl is quick test function library file QRS is a quick test recovery scenario file that is uh, that is used to store the recovery scenarios and .tsr that is a share object repository file so all these uh, files are stored in the uh, test in uh, uh, QTP if anybody you save the test so if you like this video you can just thumbs up thank you